Yeah, you know, folks, there you go. Over there, we had a bushman out here in my local bushland today doing a bit of uh, mushroom hunting. It's the season, uh, the humidity's brought out a lot of shrooms, and I'm out here looking for what I call old men of the forest. I'll show you what I'm talking about, what I'm hunting, take photographs of. Here's one of these fantastic looking blokes here. I'll give you a bit of perspective, but that's my hand, so. I find these at the base of these uh, turpentine trees and eucalypts and stuff. There's another one over here, I'll show you. They're pretty easy to spot with their shaggy caps. And I'll just climb through this scrub here. If I can without falling on my ass. There's another one over here. Growing out of this log that looks fantastic. I did take a couple of photos already. <laughs> there you go, I just fell on my ass. Alright. Mushroom hunting can be hazardous. Let's have a look at this fella. Take two. Try not to get in the light. It's not much of a shaggy cab. He's been he's been here, I'd say a week or so. You can tell that because the shags have been, I guess, melted into the head. Best way to describe it, I suppose. Whereas those other ones are um, quite shaggy still. Right, so this is the sort of area that I'm looking. Um, I'm in the she oak forest, the Casarina forest here. As you can see, these trees and their bark, Casarinas. Uh, these are the leaves, Casarina, you probably know all these. And this is a good place to start because uh, these provide really good soil for foraging now these are these are not edible I'm purely here to uh, to photograph these I'll just come up here and show you a couple more fungi that I found here's a little patch here get it to autofocus Probably not. It's a bit of a small subject. Here's a couple more here. This is the second one. No. So yeah, I'm out here today. Checking out my local area and looking for fungi. It's fun. Get out, get your camera, go for a bushwalk, clear your head, get off your devices and uh, live it up while you can. Life's too short to sit inside. These are once in a million things. Just after my fall, I had, I felt my knife come off my uh, pants. This is how it got stuck. I, I ex expected to look around and see it on the ground, but no. 
it's wedged under here like it's it's wedged really fucking good it's stuck there and it's wedged under that branch <laughs> Shit happens. The Bushman.